Hello and welcome to Trendmaker. My name is Alex and today we're going to talk about Sunlu PLA Plus Filament. So we're going to go through a couple test prints. Now the settings I was using on this printer, 50 millimeters a second, the temperature was 210, the bed at 60, and most of my settings are pretty standard of uh, standard profile, standard retraction. One of the things I like about Sunlu is it's very similar to a lot of the other top manufacturers and I really don't need to change up my settings too much. And I find that this filament is very consistent, really nice uh, printing filament, and it has a really nice finish to it. Now this was a uh, Flexi Pterodactyl. I did this at 0 0.20 filament. You can see it came out really nice. Everything was movable right from the, from the get-go. Didn't have to sort of try to break or do any modifications to this. Just came out really nice. And the layer lines here are just super smooth, really nice, even at 0.2. I did this little uh, land speeder model. Uh, this was kind of nice. And I don't know if you can see the ironing here. Get the reflection there. Really super smooth on my ironing settings. You'll notice a nice consistency amongst the color with Sunlu. Uh, here's a Benchy. You'll notice there's no real stringing inside here. Really clean. This was at 0.12 millimeters. So super smooth. All the ironing in the insides on the deck here came out nice. The smokestack is perfectly round. It's really easy to dial in. So uh, regardless of my settings, my retraction, you have a little bit more flexibility in there. It's not a really stringy uh, filament. Uh, some brands, especially some of those cheaper brands, are a little harder to dial in. You know, you got to be a little bit more specific with the temperature. This, I could I put it at 210. I've done tests at 220, even 225, and it still looks really good. I typically buy, in fact, most of the filament over here is either white, black, or gray. I do a lot of prototyping or I'm painting, so I usually don't print in color. Once in a while I do, but most of the time white, gray, or black. The black has a super slick finish. It looks really nice, very consistent. Uh, the grays look very nice, very easy to sort of sand and primer. The key to me is always what is easy, what's going to print well, what's a good price. So easy to dial in. Plus, check on this, no problem. It's easy to dial in. I feel like there's a wide range on the temperature, so you don't have to be so specific on dialing it in. I usually set the bed at 60, 210, 215, 220, all in that range. You're going to be great. Uh, the PETG is exactly the same thing. Really consistent. A lot, you know, I can be getting at 225, 230, 235, 240. Still going to look really nice. You have several options as to where to buy Sunlu filament, but I think the two best options are, one, you can buy it directly from sunlu.com. They do offer a lot of sales and specials on there, and they were nice enough to extend me a coupon code that'll get you 10% off. I'll put that down below and in the description. And what that'll do is even if it's on sale, you can use that 10% coupon with free shipping and it ends up bringing those prices really down, especially if you order one of the multi-packs. They sell uh, like individual rolls. They have a two pack, three packs, five packs and 10 packs. And that 10 pack is a really great value. And I think right now it is on sale and they distribute out of the USA, UK, Germany, Australia, China, and there may be a few others out there, so you'll get nice and fast shipping. The second option is Amazon Prime, and Amazon Prime, of course, is known for their really fast shipping, so that's an option as well. You won't get that 10% discount code. However, uh, you do a good price, and I will be constantly updating the links down below, so when I see it going on sale on Amazon, I'll definitely update those so you can get those bargains, and again, with those two packs and the five packs and the 10 packs, usually you get a really nice price so on there. That's a great way to go, and those multi-packs are really awesome. That 10-pack, you, you, know, you can get all black, you can get all white. You can get like 50-50. You can do uh, an assorted pack, which I think is a really good way to go, especially as a beginner. You can get red, blue, green, black, gray, white. Uh, I think it's a clear. Um, so you get a nice assortment. So it'll get you a nice sort of base for your printing. Uh, that's pretty much going to wrap up this video on Sunlu filament. I think uh, if you're a beginner or you've been printing a while and you haven't tried Sunlu, definitely give it a try. It is one of my favorite filaments. So do me a favor. If you haven't done so already, hit that like and subscribe down below if you're interested in more 3D printing videos. But until that next video, I'm out.